What's up, guys? So as promised, here are some test clips of this uh, Atomic uh, MD50 monoblock that I'm playing with right now. It's pretty sweet. Uh, we're gonna start with like a uh, kind of clean patch. <laughs> definition as well. Um, like a good example of this riff, uh, or a good example of that would be like this riff from uh, Jetpacks, like towards the end, but it's like... <laughs> tricking you into thinking that you're going low, the guitar can go. Um, you really need something that rings out very well. Um, you know, another test for that is like really You see, you get that um, ringing out there, but on the you still get the, the note definition there. It's really important to us. I feel like this um, this uh, power amp sort of enhances that aspect. Um, my friend Nolly and I have a, a term for this, we call it purr. You know, it's purring. I don't know if you can hear that so long on the camera. That's kind of the sound that we go for, for our distorted tone. And, uh, this thing excels at it. Hey guys, Jake with Periphery here. I, uh, I want to go over some of uh, the lead patches that I've created with the Axe going into the Atomic uh, mono block. Um, <clears throat> I have a uh, high gain tone with a lot of delay on it. So it's kind of wet in terms of delay, but it gets that really epic solo sound really well and the uh, since the uh, mono block is so fat sounding it really lends itself to playing leads really well so I have a I have a, a lead in a song that hasn't been released yet but you know I'll show it to you anyway so you can kind of get a feel of uh, um, what this thing sounds like in playing <laughs> I have uh, my 
good friend Steve Vai helping me out with this one. Um, I'm going to be demoing a uh, tech riff on a riff. Um, 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 um.